Hi guys, welcome back to Vlogmas Week 2. I'm doing this intro now because the one I did before actually I deleted by accident. So I'm just doing it today and it's Saturday so yeah. Um, so anyway, I hope you enjoy the rest of the vlog and I hope you have a nice festive week. Hi guys, I swear I always come on here with no makeup on but <laughs> you're literally used to me seeing sit used i can't speak used to seeing me without makeup but i'm just going to the gym now whoops and then i think i'm going to go home and wrap all my presents because i've not wrapped any of them and christmas is literally next week which is crazy so yeah i'm gonna go to the gym first i need like something to eat because my stomach's empty Yes, I'm just gonna go now. Might just do some cardio today because I just feel like doing cardio. Um, and yeah, I'll see you a bit later on. I might actually put some makeup on today because I just I feel a bit what well, sick of not wearing makeup. I just <laughs> I just look half dead all the time. So yeah, I'm gonna get off now. We're back and I've got some makeup on for once. I've done that trick. If you go and watch my TikTok on my lashes, as you can tell, they're quite curled. So what you do is you curl them with the curler and then you use the Benefit 24 hour brow setter. You use that on your lashes because it dries down. And then what you do is you get the curler again and heat it with your lighter Oops. Um, and then you just heat it up a little bit obviously not too much because you'll burn your lashes and then you just kind of yeah curl them <laughs> I, forgot what I, was, I forgot what I was saying curl them and then they should go really curly then and then you can put mascara on or he used like eyeliner to darken them so it wasn't too much I've just put a bit of mascara over the top and it, it's like a really good trick for if you've got straight eyelashes usually. But yeah, what I was going to say is um, I've got a meal deal. <laughs> I've got a tuna mayo sandwich, right my meal deal. Tuna mayo sandwich, hot and spicy knickknacks and a raspberry lucasade. Um, but yeah, I've just got a meal, well my mum's got me a meal deal. Um... And I'm just going to start wrapping. I think I'm going to put the Grinch on while I wrap to get in the festive spirit. I did just have um, Christmas music on in the background. But um, I think I'm just going to put film on because I feel like it. Um, but yeah. Just spray my perfume. Daisy. Absolutely love this. This was a present off my nan for my birthday because... I used to have this perfume and then I ran out and I was gutted because it's like really nice but I had the smaller one so now I've got the really big one and I'm hoping it's going to last me a bit longer um and then this one's my my nighttime fragrance not that you ask for fragrances but I just thought I'd let you know Lady Million for night and then Daisy Mark Jacobs I've been wearing at the moment um but I'm going to get to wrapping. I might just maybe film a few clips. Obviously, I can't show you the things I've bought because my family watch my videos, I think. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I don't really want to put what I'm wrapping in there. So, I'll maybe just film a few bits of me actually wrapping, but you can't see the gift, if you know what I mean. And then I'm just going to eat my food. I've literally ate half a sandwich because... I was eating it while I was doing my makeup. So yeah. Ooh. I'm gonna get on with it now. I'm what? I'm off the loading and I I don't think I'm trying to lay in bed, stare at the ceiling and switch slowly and that. I am um, I'm just watching the Grinch. I've just done some wrapping. 
I'm using this paper and it's actually really cute but the only thing is I've figured that it's slightly see-through which is stupid for wrapping paper like I mean to be honest you can't see with that one um but it's kind of like yeah it's kind of like for some for some of them that have got like say dark writing on if you like look closely it looks like I just ran out of memory but what I was saying was um yeah if it's got like dark writing it's like you can kind of read what it says on it which is not great um but to be honest it's okay we've got like loads of the wrapping paper that we kind of keep over the years so we've got this Santa one which is really cute I just love wrapping at Christmas and then these two another Christmasy red one and then this one's got penguins on it the only thing is oh there is this one as well this just like silver shimmery one the thing is like um with some of the wrapping paper like this one's like a really papery like thin one if you get what i mean like some of them feel a bit like i don't know how to explain it like not as good quality as some of them so like when you're wrapping it can like rip in certain places so that's like a little bit annoying but anyway to be honest i thought it would take me longer but i've basically done um, yeah i've literally got three more presents to wrap and and that's it like oh <laughs> i have to edit that out oh that's a lie i've got four more presents to wrap but they're like they're not massive they're like small um, this is all oh, this was in there i bought this for myself from primark how cute is that it looks something like is it the balenciaga one that's like this it's literally six pounds but you can like carry it like that and tuck the strap in or it's got a strap like this I just really liked it. It's just so really cute. And then I did get some Primark pants because they're always good. I didn't get the normal thongs that everybody gets. These are like like a V shape. Um, they're not full pants. They're like I don't know. Are they they're briefs where they're kind of they don't cover your whole bum, but they're just like half and half. If you get what I mean, but. Yeah, I got them in grey, pink and khaki, but they're in the wash, I think, because I already wore the khaki. Um, but yeah, I'm pretty much done wrapping. I'm quite happy with that, really, because it's... I can't even see the time, but yeah, it's, it's still... It's like just after lunchtime, so it hasn't took me long at all, really. But, but yeah, I'm glad to be getting it done. I have still got some more presents coming that I've ordered and then I'll just quickly wrap them up but all in all I am done with the wrapping and I'm actually quite organised this year Um, I got all of my presents done when we went shopping to Birmingham in my last vlog Um, and then it was literally just some presents for Jamie actually that I hadn't bought because he wanted some trainers and they went out of stock so I like didn't know what else to get but anyway I hope you're all having a nice week i hope you're organized as well with your gifts if not there's always something you can buy isn't there in the shop like a gift set or something and i think a lot of them are quite quite good gift sets like even like you know the costa ones where it's like a mug and you get like a hot chocolate and everything i'd love that just to have like a little costa mug and stuff like that but anyway i'm gonna get on with it um just thought i'd update you on where i am just leaving now um, to go back to Jamie's. Uh, Shut that properly. I've got this thing in my car where, like, you know, when you pull the handle and it pulls too. Well, the little latch in the door 
doesn't actually like open for me to shut the door so then when I shut it it just like bangs instead of actually closing I need to get it sorted because it's really annoying like every time I shut my door I have to literally like push the thing back up so I can close it it's just a bit of a nightmare but anyway um I'm just putting you there oh, I've actually balanced it um yeah like I said I'm just going back to Jay's now um I finished all my wrapping which I'm really glad about I have obviously like I said got some presents coming for him which I'll have to wrap when they arrive it's fine um but as well my dad bought me an advent calendar and I've only just got it recently so I'm taking it to his so we can eat the 14 days <laughs> that we have an eight um so yeah we're gonna be having to indulge on some chocolates later um i've also got i haven't showed you this but i got this for christmas the ghd um cordless straighteners they're just so cute like i just love them the only thing is with them if you want to buy them they do only stay on for like a short period of time like you do have to charge them quite a bit like i think the full charging time is like two hours and then like they're on for like 20 to 30 minutes kind of so yeah um yeah if you, if you put off by that then it just cut out again but i was just saying yeah don't buy it if you put off by that but i think they're great they're just really handy to have on the go and like take to his house i don't have to take like the ones that have corded oh my god there's a little toddler walking oh i thought he was out uh without his mom then i was like what what's going on but anyway i'm gonna go now so morning guys i'm just um well i'm working still um just put this on mute um i'm being quiet because jamie's mom's still asleep um but yeah we're just um i'm just working i'm getting my nails done later at about at four because they're like really grown out these are the birthday nails that i had in my last last vlog no my birthday glow up so um i just thought i'd update you that i'm just working um the joys um and yeah <laughs> hi guys i've just finished work um I'm going, like I said, I'm going to get my nails done in a minute, but I put some makeup on while I was, well, like on my breaks. I put some makeup on because I'm sick of looking like unpresentable. <laughs> but um, yeah, I'm going to get some Christmas nails and I'll show you when I get back. I'm literally so tired, man. Oh my god. It's like 7.38 in the morning. It's still, I mean, the blinds are closed, but it's still literally pitch black outside. But like, I'm literally so tired today. Not all week, I'm starting work at 6. So I'm literally just picking up my laptop in bed and being half asleep. <laughs> But yeah, I just thought I'd catch up. Obviously, you saw I'd had my nails done. Um, and it's like, I don't know. Which way is it? Yeah, can you see? There's a snowman on that one. And then on this one, I've got a gingerbread man. But I'm loving life. Um, I'll catch up with you later. Hi, guys. So, I'm back home. Um, oh. I'm out of breath because I've just been like sorting out my room. I've been living at Jay's for the week. Um, it's Thursday. So I've came back home today. Um, just got my little candles on here. These two are actually manifestation candles. Um, it's got a little note on the side if I turn it around. It says out with the old in with the new and then this one's also one as well but sometimes i just like to light the two light ones um i'm just watching oh my god 
um, Anastasia. But yeah, I um, I just fancied. Why well, am I still out of breath? I just fancied coming home today um, because I'm getting a little bit like fed up of just working in one space um, so I can sleep in here and I, I do have like a little office space at home so I can just go in there when I need to so yeah that's literally it really <laughs> I mean sorry for like being a little bit boring but there's not really much for me to film in the week yeah, there's not really much for me to film, so um, I'm literally just working all day and then like I'll go to the gym and eat. I haven't been to the gym today, but I've basically done a bit of a workout, sorting my room out, like it's literally made me sweat and I'm out of breath. Um, I had like a big bag of decorations there as well, because I've been wrapping all my presents, like this, you can't see. There we go. This huge bag here, that is all of my presents wrapped. Not my presents, my presents to other people <laughs> wrapped. Um, so all of my presents are done now, which I'm quite glad about. Um, I'm actually quite organised this year, to be honest. Like, Usually I'm like quite last minute. Well, not last minute, but I'm not organised. Like, there's usually something like maybe a few days before Christmas that I'm still trying to get. But yeah, everything's sorted and I'm happy about that. But I'm just gonna chill out now on my own. I might just order some food because I'm feeling it. I don't know if to order at McDonald's or I don't know what whatever takes my fancy. But yeah. I went for a KFC. I'm holding my torch above, but I've got chips gravy and a zinga burger and i just can't you can't go wrong you can't go wrong also forgot to add that i had popcorn chicken how could i forget that this is delightful guys i've tanned and washed my hair and it feels great because um my hair was like because it's lilac sometimes it goes like a can you see underneath it's like a little bit grey so basically I needed to put my bleach London shampoo and conditioner on to get it more lilac again but obviously it's a bit brighter now and more even and I was getting like it's still not fully gone but just like blondish brown roots but I've done the little contour thing with my tan so I've done it here and all around here a little bit on my nose but yeah I actually feel like alive <laughs> just need to have the back my undercut shaved because it's literally so long like I can literally pull it now it's that long it just grows so quick um but yeah I've just been doing that sorting myself out showering I think I was in the shower for ages <laughs> listen I was listening to Bruno Mars yeah happy thursday and i'll be vlogging well i'll be i'll see you tomorrow at some point um i am working again but we are having a little like family get together at mine i'm at mine now as you can tell um but yeah we're having a little family get together obviously i won't really i mean i don't know if i'll film because there's like it's a bit awkward just like whipping your camera out isn't it i'm not too sure what i'm doing the weekend it's weird that i don't actually have any plans but i'm sure there'll be something to do um and i'll take you along oh my god i've just ran up the stairs but i need to show you what we've done to the bar because i've had a really bad day at work but let's just not talk about it <laughs> um but we're having family round so what we've done is we've done up the bar for very Christmassy. Oh my god, I'm knocking everything over. <laughs> Stay. This is a sea crystal bottle 
the vodka that's empty at the moment. But yeah. guys it is saturday um i'm not really doing anything today like everybody it's like kind of one of them days where everyone else is busy but me um so what i'm gonna do is just edit this video that needs to go up tomorrow obviously i'll finish filming tomorrow but yeah i'm gonna sort it all out what I'll do is I'll bring you down, I'm going to show you how I make my coffee. Um, I do need to brush my teeth, I haven't done that yet. I know that sounds weird before I have a coffee, but yeah, I've just dropped um, Jay and his dad off at the pub. Um, but I just kind of forgot to do it before I left, so we'll do it now. Um, I mean, considering I'm not doing much, I feel like this week I just like haven't had much planned like I mean sorry about the light in here um yeah I just feel like I haven't had anything planned this week that I can like that that's interesting um what I will do though is I'll I know I did a little time lapse of me doing a little bit of my makeup yesterday um but I'll do it again today just showing you what I use um yeah i'll just turn this off now while i brush my teeth because that'll just be annoying um and i'll come back in a second cool okay so i'm gonna show you now that was weird i'm gonna show you how i make my coffee so so i've got this um I don't know if this is a what's it called you know what people make the hot chocolates with it's got something in the bottom though and I don't know if it's supposed to be loose like that but um anyway it's got like um the buttons on here so you've got like cappuccino latte I think that's macchiato and then this one's you can have actually cold milk um, but I'm just going to have oat milk and then I'll just use a glass mug so you just put your coffee in as normal about that much and then what 
I do is I boil the kettle. Um, I won't turn it on yet. Um, just so, so it gets to maybe there. Because when I put the milk in, it doesn't... If I just left it like that, it only fills the cup to, like, here. So I need to put some water in. I'll do that now. And then you have to fill it up. So when you open it, there's a max line and a min line. So I'll fill it up to the max line. And then what I'm going to do, shut it. And I'm going to make this into a cappuccino. So you just press it once. And then what that should do start spinning round like that and then that should froth up the milk so that's just boiling I'll show you when I pour it out in a second see with oat milk with oat milk it never actually goes that frothy because of it I don't know I just don't think it froths up as much as normal milk Um that was literally on the cappuccino setting and usually it's quite thick foam but oh well when you when you wash it as well obviously you can't get the bottom wet I mean it's slightly there Um so you literally have to like basically just rinse it out with soap um, yeah, obviously you can't just use water because, it, yeah, you'll get that like milky smell and it's like not very nice. <laughs> but yeah, this was literally off Amazon and it's great. Like, it's the best thing I've bought. Well, so yeah, if you just search um, milk frother in Amazon, that should come up. Just give it a stir. I had to have some breakfast, but I don't really know what to have. Well, breakfast, it's literally 12 o'clock. <laughs> I literally woke up at um, 11 today because all week I've been working um, 6 till 3. And it, it has actually killed me this week. Like, um, the thing is, <laughs> with my job, we have to reply to customers. Um, I won't tell you who I work for, but um, I'm basically a customer service advisor um, for beauty brands. Um, so I have to reply to customers, and like we've just been put on to calls, um, like taking calls, and I just, I'm just like really, I find it hard to be comfortable with calls, like because when since we've started we've just done emails and just replying back on there which is quite easy to be honest and it just it, I quite enjoyed <clears throat> I quite enjoyed just sitting there doing emails but like ever since we've been put on calls I'm just like I get really flustered <laughs> I don't know if anybody else does this job but I just yeah <laughs> I'm just needing a bit of assistance at the moment because yeah it's not great but anyway, <laughs> enough about that. I'm going to edit this video. <coughs> My voice is going. I've got no idea what to have to eat now because I feel like 12 is such an awkward time to eat because you don't know whether to have breakfast or lunch. Um, but I don't really, I don't feel hungry yet. I might just eat when I'm hungry um but i don't know if it's because we had a massive chinese last night which was really nice i just wanted to like vent well not vent but like you know speak to you <laughs> speak to the camera about what's happening i think i've just been like quite stressed and like i've been finishing work with a bit of like a nervous stomach um it's like yesterday I went to have um, a pill check at the at the doctor's um, just for like my contraceptive pill and um, 
she, she you obviously have to have your blood your blood pressure taken don't you and um she measured it and it was like a little bit high so now i've literally got to check actually that's reminded me i need to do it today yeah she said like i need to take my blood pressure like morning and night for seven days now because of that and I, I literally said to her I was like I think it's because I've been anxious all day to be honest um but yeah because usually it's never it's usually fine so I don't think that's helped but anyway um yeah I'll do that now guys I'm actually quite sad um I found this notebook let me just put my tripod out properly so you can stand you up. Yeah, so this notebook we used to be like I used to write my notes down for uni. I did have a few other notebooks that I used, but I've just it's because I've used this one for like writing manifestations and that as well. So like that's my last the last page I wrote which is for manifestation. And then like before that I just have random things about like my bookings for makeup and then I have a random creative page um because I got into that I got you know the girl off um TikTok um I'm going off topic here but you know the girl off TikTok that does like um journaling and she does all like the sticking um like she has the stickers and the paper that she cuts out and sticks down I got really into that and then wanted to do it myself so I was doing it in this book I think there's another one I was doing it in as well um but yeah I was just like scrolling through and um it's actually making me sad like I miss uni so much like I just love I loved uni I just loved it like I loved the course I made like amazing friends and <laughs> it's actually quite sad that I'm not there anymore um like, I was looking at like some of the notes I'd wrote down and like like here I'd literally um done some work on Daenerys from Game of Thrones um because that was one of the characters I had to recreate and it was like on photoshop and you had to like edit them to make them look like a new character but oh, we just did such cool things I mean I don't me I don't miss like the amount of words and things you had to write um, because that did get did get a little bit much because you kind of end up procrastinating but I do miss it a lot like it was just I, I just I just love like that industry and like I felt like I was already in the industry when I was at uni and obviously when you come out you just kind of well not left to yourself because they do still help you but yeah you're kind of on you on your own a little bit so you're just like oh but yeah I just wanted to <laughs> say that I'm a little bit um it's like reminiscing on memories but I do have a new um notebook that I'm going to use for like manifestations and my best friend got me this and um her parents for my birthday so I'm going to be using this now um because it's just it makes sense doesn't it <laughs> i think i'm going to try and write in this more often to just help me stay positive and stay in the right mindset um because i do sometimes just end up falling into like a negative mindset um but yeah <laughs> guys i've done this little christmas glam it looks really pink but it was actually a red shadow and it was um <laughs> believe it or not this is a kylie cosmetics palette but what happened was the sh the eyeshadow palette got water damaged i don't i think it's because um the water spray that i use um i kept it in the in my palette drawer which is here um and i have water spray for like my water activated paints and it leaked onto the palette and ruined it basically which I was gutted about because at the time you could only get it from America and I had it as a gift so I was literally like oh my god so what I did was I bought a palette off I think it was off eBay and I literally stuck the shadows in anyway yeah I stuck them all in and obviously there was a few that I had to chuck away because they were like really damaged but this palette is 
honestly so good. And oh, I used um, a silver eyeliner, the NYX Epic Wear, and it's so good. Let me just... Like, look at that. Amazing. But yeah, I'm literally loving this. I'm not even going anywhere, but... <laughs> Hi, guys. I'm just running a bath. Um, so... I think I'm going to have to shout because it's quite loud but I'm just going to be using these bath salts, they're my mum's but they're like mindful ones and I just think I kind of need that <laughs> at the moment. So um, it says to use two to three handfuls to warm water to create a fragrant mineral infused bath and it emerged feeling sensitive to calm and relax and maybe it took them in then oh my god west lab let's put them up here because it's literally all under my nails <laughs> yeah so it's by west lab and it's the mindful one. Uh, frankincense, bergamot and CBD. So obviously that's good for like, um, like calming, calming things. I'm also going to put some of the muscle, so, uh, sorry, stress relief in because I need that as well. <laughs> 